The mysterious connection between the physical world and mathematics runs deep. Mathematics is not just solving X, but also figuring out Y. Almost everyone learned about the number pi in school, but relatively extremely very few people learned about phi. Perhaps for the very reason that grasping all its manifestations often takes one beyond the academic into the realms of the spiritual just by the simple fact that phi unveil an unusually frequent constant of design that applies to so many aspects of life. Even if you are not aware of the golden ratio, your subconscious mind was inclined towards this concept. The brain swiftly accepts any image that makes use of the golden ratio faster. So, it's a signal to the brain that the image is aesthetically pleasing. In fact, our brains are drawn towards images and objects that use a golden ratio. It is a subconscious attraction. The essence of the golden ratio is to create a sense of beauty through balance and harmony. Artists, illustrators, photographers, or even graphic designers, no matter what field of design they are in, majority of them consider the golden ratio on any design project. Think about it. What do the Taj Mahal, the stars on the flag, the logos of many car manufacturers and your DNA all have in common? They all share a common proportion in the dimensions of their designs, the golden ratio. What makes this so much more than an interesting exercise in mathematics is that this proportion appeared throughout creation. It's found in the proportions of many other animals, in plants, and even in the solar system. Pineapples, cauliflowers, many plants all grow in a numerical sequence. Curiously enough, we even find golden ratio relationships in the solar systems and the universe. The diameters of the Earth and Moon form a triangle whose dimensions are based on the mathematical characteristics of phi. Distances of the planets from the suns correlate surprisingly closely to exponential powers of phi. The beautiful rings of Saturn are very close in dimensions to the golden ratio of the planet's diameter. More intriguing yet is the extensive appearance of phi throughout the human form in the face, body, fingers, teeth, and even our DNA, and the impact that this has in our perception of human beauty. Some would argue that beauty is in the eye of the beholder, but there is evidence to support that what we perceive as beauty in women and men is based on how closely the proportions of facial and body dimensions come to phi. It seems that phi is hardwired into our consciousness as a guide to beauty. For this reason, phi is applied in both facial plastic surgery and cosmetics as a guide to achieving the most natural and beautiful results in facial features and appearance. With all the unique mathematical properties of phi and its appearance throughout creation, it's little wonder that mankind would not only take notice of this number and the golden ratio it creates, but also use it to capture the beauty and harmony of nature in our own creations in art, architecture, and other areas of design. In regards to pine cone, look carefully and you'll notice that the bracts that make up the cones are arranged in a spiral. Actually two spirals running in opposite directions with one rising steeply and the other gradually from the cone's base to its tips. A snail shell, a hurricane, a whirlpool, and our own galaxy all share the same distinct spiral shape. The same words pattern governs them all. Now that you know that the mysterious connections between the physical world and mathematics runs deep, I hope it reminds you that mathematics can be inspiring too and is not always about solving X. Do not be too serious about this ratio and theory. Just enjoy and be in awe as you feast into the galaxies and the environment around you.
or even when you look at yourself. Does this fascinate you? Please leave your comments below. Thank you.